हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल आज हम देखने वाले स्टैंडर्ड फाइव एनुअल में स्टडी का 23 चैप्टर्स इंफेक्शन डिसीज एंड हाउ टू प्रिवेंट इट उसके क्वेश्चंस एंड आंसर तो चलिए देखते हैं अपने चैप्टर का फर्स्ट क्वेश्चंस तो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चंस क्या है व्हाट्स द सॉल्यूशन यू आर वेरी हंग्री बट द फूड हैज बीन लेफ्ट अनकवर्ड आंसर इफ द फूड इज लेफ्ट अनकवर्ड इट विल बी contaminated with dirt dust and flies many microorganisms may be present in them such food can cause infection therefore such food should not be eaten if we are hungry we can eat packed biscuits or fruits like banana which can be peeled and eaten if we food is boiling hot we can consume others even if we are very hungry we should not eat uncovered food Second A, use of brain power. First A, which method of preventing the breeding of mosquitoes will you recommended for your surrounding? Not allowing water to stain net or spraying insecticides on the water and why? Answer, if in the stagnant water mosquitoes breed, mosquitoes spread disease like malaria, dengue and elephantiasis. therefore stagnant water should not allow to retain in our surrounding one can also use insecticide to destroy mosquitoes but this would also create insecticides pollution insecticides have ability to stay in the environment for an extended period and they harm the environment therefore it is better to remove stagnant water than to spray insecticide question 3 hai answer the following questions उसमें ए है व्हाट इज एन इंफेक्शियस डिसीज अगर आप चैनल पे नए हो चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कर लीजिए वीडियो को लाइक कीजिए और वीडियो ज्यादा से ज्यादा शेयर कीजिए आंसर है द डिसीज कॉज बाय स्पेसिफिक माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिज्म इज एन इंफेक्शियस डिसीज इट इज ट्रांसमिटेड फ्रॉम वन पर्सन टू अन अदर टू इंफेक्शन बी क्वेश्चन से व्हाट इज द मीडियम्स ऑफ द स्प्रेड ऑफ डिसीज आंसर कॉन्टिनेंटेड एयर water food are the mediums of the spread of disease lysplea and mosquitoes also spread certain diseases in case of skin diseases direct contact through touch and contact with contaminated clothes or utensils can also cause disease see hey, what happens when there is an epidemic of disease answer when the epidemic of disease is spread many people from a particular area become ill with the same disease at same time d hey, what is vaccination answer vaccination is the process in which the vaccine is given to person or child through injection or an oral dose this vaccine builds resistance against a certain disease when the disease causing germs enter our body we already have the ability to fight against this germ so we do do not get the disease due to vaccination the outbreak of epidemic can be controlled and disease prevention can be done children are given vaccination for many diseases as their resistance power is weak community programs for vaccination are also done to control epidemics the question say make a list of vaccination that are given to a newborn baby answer polio oral vaccine is given to build resistance against polio second a bcg or anti tuberculosis vaccine third triple vaccine given against whooping cough diarrhea and tetanus fourth a true or false usme a hai intestinal disease spread through air answer false second a b some diseases are caused the anger of the gods agar aap channel pe naye ho channel ko subscribe kar lijiye video ko like kijiye aur video ko jaldi se jaldi share kijiye answer a false hip question se classify the disease given below as disease that spread through food through water and through air to yahan par bracket kiye hue hai theek hai तो बॉक्स में थ्रू एयर थ्रू फूड और थ्रू वाटर कौन कौन से ट्यूबरकुलसिस एपेरिया उसमें बाद थ्रू फूड कौन कौन से टाइफाइड क्लोरेला जॉन्डिस गैस्ट्रो और डायरिया थ्रू वाटर टाइफाइड क्लोरेला जॉन्डिस गैस्ट्रो और डायरिया सिक्स गिव रीजन 
उसमें ए है वेन देर इज एन एपिडेमिक्स ऑफ क्लोरेला वी शुड ड्रिंक बॉइल वाटर आंसर जम क्लोरेला जम्स ऑफ क्लोरेला स्प्रेड थ्रू फेसेस ऑफ पेशेंट दे पास इन टू वाटर और फूड If such contaminated waters is used for drinking, others may get the infection of chlorella. Therefore, during an epidemic of chlorella, water should be boiled. Boiling destroys the germs in the water, and therefore we are protected against the germs. In order to keep our health safe, we should drink boiled water. Next question say we should not allow puddles of water to stand in our surrounding. Answer: Stagnant water of puddles is the breeding ground for mosquitoes. Germs causing malaria are transmitted through mosquitoes. Bite from the patient to other peoples. Epidemics of such diseases will spread if mosquitoes are abundant. Therefore, to control infections of malaria and dengue, we should eradicate mosquitoes. Hence, we should not allow puddles of water to stand in our surrounding. थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग वीडियो इयत्ता पांचवी या मराठी सेमी आणि इंग्रजी या माध्यमांच्या सर्व विषयांच्या स्वाध्यायाच्या नवनवीन व्हिडिओ साठी चॅनलला सबस्क्राईब नक्की करा लाईक करा कमेंट करा आणि वर्ग मित्रांना शेअर करा